The Physiology of Drunk Driving, Visual Acuity, Motor Control, and Reaction Time, Part 1. Driving demands good muscular coordination, quick reflexes, keen observation, and the capacity for effective information processing. Alcohol intoxication will drastically reduce your capacity to drive safely because it has a negative impact on each of these abilities. For example, if you drive after drinking, you might not be able to read traffic signs or identify risks on the road if your vision is impaired. Your activities will be clumsy due to slow reflexes. You can make a wide curve or stop either too suddenly or not abrupt enough. Focus issues may cause you to overlook crucial duties, including turning on your headlights or monitoring your speed. In addition to these obvious limitations, being intoxicated may put you in danger if you start to feel sick. Alcohol can make you feel dizzy, nauseous, and a lot of other physical symptoms that could keep you from concentrating on driving. Let's examine the specific risks associated with drunk driving in more detail. Vision Effects of Alcohol Driving safely is impossible without strong vision. Even while other senses are crucial, a driver's eyes are the primary source of information about the environment around them on the road. Your mental image of the road surrounding your vehicle will be incomplete if your vision is impaired. Your assessment of the road will be wrong if important details are absent, such the existence of a stop sign or approaching cross traffic, and you won't be able to make safe driving decisions. Error Fixation For drunk drivers, object fixation, staring at one thing or a location on the road for an extended period of time poses a major risk. The little muscles that move your eyes in their sockets are damaged by alcohol's effects on the nervous system, which restricts your brain's ability to manage your body. You will be more prone to fixating on a single location when your eyes are restricted from moving as easily. You can miss a whole host of other crucial things on the road that are happening while this is going on. Things behind or to the side of your car, as well as anything in your blind zones, are likely to go unseen. Impossible to focus. After consuming alcohol, your eyes' corneas and lenses become less sensitive to messages from your brain. These elements typically enable your eyes to narrow in on a particular object and to obtain in-depth knowledge of a particular section of the road. You will find it difficult to concentrate while intoxicated on small details like road signs, traffic lights, or distant scenes on the road. You might even begin to experience double vision if alcohol has also affected how precisely your eye's lenses focus. Dizzy Vision You will have worse long-distance vision while under the influence of alcohol. Your target area up ahead, including nearby objects, other cars, and essential traffic control devices, may appear hazy. It could be difficult for you to tell the difference between the lanes of the road or to pinpoint the exact location of other drivers. Light Surfictions Your capacity to recognize contrast is impacted by alcohol. This will make it challenging to discern between various things on a section of road that is poorly, or extremely, illuminated. You can mistake a person for a street sign or another car for a dumpster when scanning the road ahead. It is dangerous to be unable to discern between things in any circumstance, but it is more dangerous during night, in climate weather, or when visibility is already low for other reasons. Tragically, because social drinking events typically take place in the evening, the majority of DUI accidents actually happen there when visibility is low. It is hardly surprising that intoxicated drivers cause so many collisions at night. Alcohol's impact on the eye's pupils causes a loss of contrast perception. In a healthy, sober person, the pupils quickly dilate and enlarge in response to changing lighting conditions, either to let in more light or to block out dangerously strong light. Alcohol considerably slows down this process. You might discover while drunk that when a car with active high beams approaches at night, the quick change from darkness to light could hurt and momentarily impair your vision. You might not be able to distinguish any details at all if there is a quick change from light to dark, when you turn from a well-lit thoroughfare into a darker side road. Before your eyes can adjust, everything may appear dark, and by the time they do, you may have hit another vehicle or veered off the road. Peripheral Vision and Depth Perception Due to alcohol's tendency to narrow peripheral vision, drunk drivers frequently complain of having tunnel vision. As a result, you would be far less conscious of activities going on around your car. Your sense of depth will also be impacted. 
you will have trouble judging how far away items are and how much space there is around your car if your depth perception is compromised. As a result, effective space management on the road will be next to impossible. The most crucial skill for a driver to have is probably vision. Without it, every action you take and decision you make while driving would be erroneous and possibly dangerous. Do not believe that you are good enough to drive safely after drinking because of alcohol-induced poor judgment. No driver on the planet is proficient enough to operate a vehicle safely without making full use of their eyes.